Geralt. What is it? Nothing just yet, but something's afoot. Philippa and Margarita want to speak to me. They say about what? No, but I have my suspicions. I bet they have plans for me. And they're deigning to inform me of them. Got nothing to be afraid of. Just go. Listen to what they have to say. And if they try to force me into something? Can't believe you'd ever let them. Margarita's only ever cared about your education. Doubt she'll try to drag you into politics. Philip is tougher, plays a mean game, but ultimately respects those who hold to their views. If she makes you an offer, and you firmly turn it down, she'll respect that. Thanks, Carol. Well, go. Don't give him any more time to strategize. Seriously. True. Good decision. Relax. She'll be fine. Rita won't hurt her, but Philippa. She can be ruthless. Siri's been in tougher situations and come out of them all right. True. We managed to instill some principles, skills that have helped. Exactly. So there's nothing to be afraid of. Of course. I'll just have a peek. Don't spy on her. You really have that little faith. I don't trust Philippa and Rita. So why do you even allow this meeting to happen? For the same reason you did. If they're to respect her, she can't be seen to be hanging on to my apron strings. What do you see? Philippa pontificating. Siri pacing wall to wall. She stopped. She's saying something. Philippa's turned pale. That's my Siri. Probably gave her an earful. Quiet! Here she comes. So? You were eavesdropping? Yes. No. Oh, you haven't changed a bit. Tell us what you talked about. I'd rather not. Not yet, at least. Of course. When you're ready. I must unwind. I'll go for a walk. Foot in mouth, as usual. What are you talking about? Nothing. Just wanted to. Go meet Avalon. He wished to see you, apparently. Witcher, at last. Now, we're all present. Then up the fucking creek. Why have you summoned us? Radovid's on his ship. We'll not get to him there, I've told you. Stop it! I have an idea how to draw him onto dry land. But all in due course. Let's start by confessing our sins. I let Philippa Eilhart in on our plan. Hey, a culpa. Bravo! Bloody bravo! Now, now. It's not a disaster. The Lady Sorceress is highly unlikely to warn the brat. What's more, she's willing to help us kill him. Naturally, it's nothing I'll ever agree to. But Phil, she's inspired me. Call her my muse. Inspired you to do what? Patience. We've yet to get to the substance of the matter. Geralt, do I recall correctly that Radovid's hired you to find Philippa? You're nosy. Starting to piss me off, you know? I know. Forgive me. It comes with the job. No. You're not a spy anymore. Remember? Chose the life of a criminal. No. 
That choice was made for me. Philippa forced me to flee Redania. Radovid prevented me from returning. Dijkstra, infernally sad story. Really fucking tugs at the art strings. But do you mind getting back to the matter at hand? Yes, right. Geralt, be so kind as to answer the question. He give you the contract or not? Mm hmm Only thing I've found is her hideout. What's your point? We can use Philippa without involving her, provided you help. Radovid expects you to report to him, bring him information about her. All you need to do is mention her name, intimate that you've a lead, you're on her trail. Oh, he'll swallow that. Hook, line, sinker, and a good bit of the rod as well. Let's say Radovid bites, believes me, and none of that's a given. What then? You'll tell him you've found Philippa's hideout. Somewhere where we can easily set a trap and ambush. Suggestions? Bridge to Temple Isle. Built up both sides. Lots of nooks, gates. Easy to block off from the rest of the city. Good idea. I'll divide my men and post half on one end, other half on the other, by the gate. And in the middle, Vess, with a well-oiled crossbow. You see, Geralt? All we ask is that you invite Radovid out for a stroll, bring him to the bridge. We'll take care of the rest. So what'll it be? I'm in. But once it's done, what then? There'll be an uproar in the city. Panic, maybe. Need a place where we can wait it out. Thought of that already. Remember Madame Arena's theatre? Abandoned now, not a soul looks in there. Tala and I will await you there. Await us? Unwilling to risk your own necks? Not the point. Deeks and I have many cocksucking virtues, but fighting ability is just not one of them. Not as fit for that as we are for a bleeding beauty pageant. Don't worry, Geralt. My people are battle hardened. They'll manage. You just bring them the king. Do what I can. Where's his ship moored these days? Just round the corner in Novograd's port. And for your sake, I hope he's in a good mood when you look in on him. Philippa? What the hell are you doing here? Geralt, don't ask questions you know the answers to. It makes you look stupid. Eavesdropping on your conversation, naturally. With a good deal of interest. And a measure of wonder. Mind telling me what you found puzzling? Your naivety. Do you honestly believe Radovid will fall for such a crude ruse? Might be tough to trick, but I think I'll manage. Hmm. I hope you take a more serious approach to confronting the Wild Hunt. Provided, of course, you survive long enough to undertake it. Philippa, why even tell me this? Concerned about me that much? Not at all. It's because I think it vital that Radovid die. You don't want my help, more for pity. But I shall do what I can to make certain you don't fuck it up. Here, take this. A ring. Redanian eagle etched in the ruby. It belonged to Vizimir, Radovid's father. Hand him that, and he may believe you captured me. He might even choose to trust you. Helpful. Thanks. Don't mention it. Believe me, I'm prepared to do much more to be rid of Radovid. Good luck, Geralt. You'll need it. An audience. Got new information about Philippa Eilhart. I'll need your weapons. Now follow me. Your Majesty, the Witcher, with news of Philippa Eilhart. I hope you brought something better than magic crystals this time. I know where she is. Perhaps. Or perhaps you seek to trick me, like the others. What others? Ah. You see, a rumor went around that I'd generously reward any who bring information about Eilhart. 
there's no shortage of the greedy and the stupid. So a queue quickly formed at the gangway to the ship. The first aboard was a hunter. Brought me a dead owl with no eyes. He thought I'd believe it, shower him with gold. I had him blinded, then thrown overboard with a stone tied round his neck. The second was the postmaster from Oxenfurt. Claimed to have a letter she'd penned. It was forged, of course. I had his fingers cut off. He'll never write again. Oh, and I took his tongue. The spoken lie is just as reprehensible. Needless to say, the rest of the queue dispersed quickly. I'm a professional. Got a reputation to uphold. Be stupid of me to come to you empty-handed. My father's ring. Philippa used it to stamp her decrees, then distribute them as the word of the king. Where is she? Under your nose, sire. In Novigrad, in a house on the bridge leading to Temple Isle. Why haven't you brought her to me? Gotta capture someone to take them anywhere. All I did was track her down, then stole this ring as proof that I had. Do you fear her? No. You want to kill her yourself. With your own hands. I know this. You shall come with me. Hubrecht, gather the men. How many, sire? All of them. Well, where is she? Where is Philippa? Like I said, house on the bridge, closer to the other end. Close off this end. We need no guests, no innocent bystanders, or witnesses. Damian, Duke, Egbert, Freak, Kaspar. You shall stay here, secure the rear, and kill the Witcher. This how you reward those who serve you? It is how I punish those who irritate me. You know too much. You impede me too often. And I find your arrogance an annoyance. I've had men killed for less. Follow me. Any last words? Oh, fuck! Free the Witcher, then run of it. Hang on, Gerald. On our way. Stay in formation. Gone to hell. So be it. We'll improvise. Follow me, Geralt. We must get to Radovid before reinforcements arrive. Not your lucky day.
Open up! I command you to open the door! You needed merely to ask. That settles the score. And that was from the heart. Forgive me. I could not deny myself the pleasure. How did she... Where? Why? How the fuck? Eve's dropped on us, back at the warehouse. What? And you didn't think it worth mentioning? Lads, the time to discuss this is later. Radovid is dead. It matters not by whose hand. Mission accomplished. Now let's get the hell away. Place will be thick with Redanians in minutes. Let's go. Is it done? It's done. Though all did not go according to plan. More on that later. First a stiff drink and a toast. The North. Temeria. Temeria! Bloody Temeria! Temeria. Ah. What now, Roach? A new guerrilla campaign against the Black Ones? No. The war just ended. How's that? There's something I don't know about? I'd say so. You see, tomorrow at noon, the commander of Army Group Center will sign a truce in Amir's name. A truce whose wording we agreed with Dijkstra. So back there in Velen, when the trolls nabbed you? Yes. I was returning from the last round of talks. Amir will keep Edion and Lyria, but in exchange for Radovich Head and a stop to guerrilla activities, he will withdraw from Temeria, which will become the Empire's vassal state. Self-ruled internally, with its own courts, administrative structures and army. The silver lilies will bloom neath the rays of the great sun. So I say were I a poet. But I'm not, so all I'll say is there was no other fucking way. Haven't told me the whole truth. You're right on that account. We know you're bloody allergic to politics, decided to emphasize majors and whatnot. If it were done when tis done, then twere well it were done quickly. That but this blow might be the be-all and end-all here. What's that? Vakmeth, Act 1, Scene 7. Always wanted to play that. Never cast as anything but a halberdier. Geralt, what Tala told you, put it out of your mind. There will be no truce with Nilfgaard. Redania, under my enlightened rule, will fight on until it wins. And when it does, it will unite all the North, including Temeria. What? Ow! This is not what we plough and agreed. True. Instead, we insisted on one realm's questionable sovereignty. And to recover it, we gave Amir virtually all the North's other kingdoms. It was not a wise arrangement. So, no deal. You two-faced horseman. I will not allow this. Actually, you, Roach, should be the first to understand I've no choice. 
Why the hell would I understand? Because you too are a patriot. Geralt, this doesn't concern you. You may go. Fare thee well on your path or whatnot. Can't let you kill them, Dijkstra. Oh, hard luck. Then you'll die with them. Kill them all. Bloody hell! Bugger me sideways! That was close. Very close. It's hardly over. The envoy, due to meet the Nilf Guardians tomorrow. No doubt Dijkstra ordered him killed. We'll need to protect him. Sorry, you're on your own, I've... You've had your fill of politics, I understand. Once it's over, come to Vizima. You'll be received with honors. Farewell, Wolf. I know this house. Supposed to drive a godling from here. Supposed to? Decided it was harmless. Passages here, past this wall. This is the place. Once we enter, there'll be no returning until we reach Gels. Ready? Yes, let's go. Remember, wherever you land, search for a place that looks like this one. We shall meet sooner or later. Mean we'll be separated? It's possible. I lack your ward's talent. Zirel is the lady of time and space. I merely know how to use this arcane knowledge to a limited degree. It's time. I hate portals. Welcome to the Diderwet Desert. There's somewhere in our world. Ever seen such canyons in your world? Come, we must go. What is this place? A very old world, thoroughly raped and destroyed. Anything live here? Mainly desert creatures, able to survive months on end without water. Oh, and large sand crabs beneath the surface. We must be careful they don't sense us. And before, were there any people or elves? Do you believe humanoids have a monopoly on destroying worlds? So what did live here? Sentient monsters of some sort? Look at those cliffs. Remind you of anything? Hmm. Look a bit like the bed of a giant river. Or the bottom of a sea? Mean there were water creatures here once? No creatures. Merely a sea. Trying to say that... 
that there are many different worlds and even more forms of life. Many of them intelligent, much more so in fact than you humans. But as it turns out, not even that could stop them from exhausting all the resources of their world to the last drop. Ah, the portal. Looks more like a ruin. Appearances can be deceiving. So what are we waiting for? For it to open. Shouldn't take but a few moments. What's going on? The sand crabs have sensed our presence. Wonderful. suffocated.
like this. Someone must have lit it. With any luck, it was a certain grouchy elven sage. It snows up to the rooftops. Wonder how long this blizzard's been blowing. Took you a while? Did you run into trouble? Uh, no. Just taking in the sights. What is this place? Feels like I've been here before. You have. You fought Eredin's projection here. Before that, Ciri fought here. For you. What are you talking about? Ever wondered how you managed to leave the Red Riders? Many times, but I don't remember a thing. Siri came for you. 
She sensed you were in danger, tore you from the hunt's grasp, then deposited you in the woods near Kaer Morhen. Did Aridan start hunting her because of that? Because of me? Why didn't she say anything? <sighs> what would it have changed? Where are we? World of the NL? No. This is Ted Dera, the time of the end. The world destroyed by the White Frost. Alas, this awaits us all, though at differing stages of our existence. So calm when you say that. Eridan succumbed to his knowledge of the Apocalypse. Fear rules him now. I'll not commit the same error. Care to clarify? Not here. Not now. Going after Gels is proving quite a trek, but I still don't know why he's so important. Eredin differs from the king he killed. Power for its own sake interests him. He has little patience for bureaucracy. He spends most of his time atop his steed, leading the Red Riders. So what does he need in the capital? A good viceroy. Gels is an excellent administrator and an even better plotter. He's the most dangerous individual amongst the NL. He got any weaknesses? Yes. He's righteous. I was hoping we wouldn't get separated. I warned you it could happen. Where'd your journey take you? Through a world whose son had just died. I barely reached the next passage in time. Light on the peak. Was that you? I thought it might aid your passage. After all, that is what lighthouses do. Show the way. Doesn't look safe here either. Let's go. This way. Next passage. When will it open? Shortly. of Awakening, formerly the Moon Palace, Gel's headquarters. <sighs> Beautiful. I'm glad to know you appreciate it. Elven architecture is a bit more sophisticated than yours. Oh, who's this? And why are they here? I believe we're done for the day, my tulip. Be a dear and leave us alone. For I think we can agree this matter is between us and us alone, correct? Crivana, Spain, at Coleman Maca and the Witcher of Rivia. Ketman. Do you like my new model? Something of Lara Doran about her, wouldn't you agree, Griva? Her height, perhaps. Nothing more. <laughs> I see I've touched a tender spot. So let's change the subject, shall we? Care for a drink? Got any vodka? Oh, yeah. I keep forgetting you don't touch that filth, disgraceful as it is. Hmm. I must admit, you appearing here. Quite the surprise, Witcher. Incidentally, interesting choice of allies. Do you think Avalach is honest with you? Just curious. No, but honesty's not a facet of your species. 
So quit spewing bile. Won't gain you anything. I detect a shadow of impatience in your faces, it seems. So what brings you here? I've come to tell you who killed our king. You've gone through a great deal of trouble to reach me. So I must believe you've put equal effort into preparing this lie. You shall see the truth. You will dream it. You've been a neuromancer. My intuition was correct. This will be interesting. Better believe it. This way, please. Witcher Geralt. A true man of action. Might I know where we're going? To the world of the Enshe. Directly this time. Let's go, before any guards show up. I take it I needn't introduce our guest. Greetings, Cyril. So it's true. The swallow has befriended the fox. There's naught you can do to make us turn on one another. Havalach blackmailed you. Do you not remember? Tried to force you to warm our king's bed. Treated your body like a side of pork. I remember. But I also remember what you advise Eredin do with me once I was caught. And I remember what the Red Riders did at Kaer Morhen. I didn't come here to argue. The proof you promised. Where is it? You will see it. In your dream. Ah, yes. You're near, Lancer. Visions that cannot be fabricated. Do you wish to show me how Eredin murdered our king? What then? Am I to incite the NL against Eredin? Call for revolution? and proclaim Avalach our new king. Don't flatter yourself. Defy Eredin. That's all you need to do. Very well. Have your oracle summon dreams of my king's last moments. We shall all dream them, to make certain there are no misunderstandings. Why not? Face him on your terms, in this world, in a place of your choosing. It's your only chance. Sail to Skellige and find the Sunstone. With it, you will summon the Nargofair. Eredin will come too. Should he call for reinforcements, no Enhel will answer. You have done the thing most just. A new portal to Tin Aliar will open. I shall stabilize it and you will return. Come with me.
Just as well. Could have been bluffing. Might have just said that so we'd let him go. Damn it. We should have pressed him. Calm down. Avalok knows him better. We'll hear him out when he returns. Speak of the devil. Geralt's worried. He believes we let Gales go too easily. Can never be too careful. Agreed. Yet I do believe Gels will keep his word, withhold support from Eredin. Seems to me you have a plan. Care to share it with us? Once we find the Sunstone, aided by your sorceresses and their magic, we shall draw Eredin's ship to a bay along the coast of Undvik. We will wait in ambush, lay a trap. When the King of the Hunt arrives, we will spring it and kill him. Just like that? Defeating Eredin will be no small feat. But we will accomplish it. Gather everyone and we'll meet at the port. Then we sail to Skellige.